time here at the Fight Project MMA Series. Myself, Phil Campbell, in with Josh Paul. We have Dylan Douglas taking on Leon Hill. Three five minute rounds, elbows are legal, knees to the head are legal, and things just got a lot more interesting. Yeah, Leon looks like he should have a good reach advantage here. Dylan's doing well, they close the distance. Dylan Douglas, renowned for having the best eyebrows in the game. Now has one of the best moustaches in the game. Fair play to the young man who's in on the single leg right now. We alluded, it, we alluded to it at the start during the walkouts, Josh. A distinct height and size advantage for Leon Hill in this bout. Yeah, Leon looks like he's definitely not 73 kilos at this moment, so he must cut a good bit of weight, and Dylan is probably a bit undersized. Oh, huge knee yeah, from Leon Hill. He just took two knees to the face there for trying to get a takedown. Nice work of the shorter fighter doing the right thing, trying to get into the body, trying to get in close, close that distance. Met the takedown well there, change levels. Leon Hill out of Team KF trying to get the double underhooks here. Yep. Frame off elbow from Douglas. Nice wee knee there. Always going to be difficult in this position when you have the taller fighter, six foot plus, dropping down the level, then forcing his head. Another big knee. Yeah, you can just get a lot of leverage in it. Knee in him in the head doesn't actually appear to be that high, for, unfortunately, in Dylan's case. Dylan Douglas does have double underhooks against the cage now. But there's nice work from Hill to change levels against the cage, maybe trying to hit the double. secures it and as we said in the cage when I was speaking to Reese McKee he said if you were to look at uh, Dylan's record yes it's he hasn't picked up a win yet as a pro but in every fight he has been competitive he has shown great heart resilience technical ability so you feel like he is only one or two stages away from putting everything together as a pro yeah one thing you can't say about Dylan he's always tries his hardest mm -hmm. and he's got a great work ethic whenever he's in there he's in on that figure four grip may not necessarily use it for this admission it's a great grip to use to transition to sweep. Still holding on to it. Hill keeping everything as compact as possible. Steps yeah. over into the mount position. Dylan trying to work diligently Dylan. to get to the feet. Does so. Yeah, brilliant from Dylan. Dylan there. Again, Hill changes levels. Split base here from Douglas. Ankle pick. Hands connected. Take down for Leon Hill. Again, has that Kimura grip. Very fast pace so far. You have to remember, these are three five minute rounds as we are now in the professional ranks. Big elbow from Leon Hill. Leon Hill in that half guard position that's commonly known now as the anchor position. A lot of fighters seem happy to sit yeah. from there and do their work. I think it's mountain side control. If the other person can move about a lot, whereas yeah. half guard, you kind of can get a good few shots away. And He's you're in relatively safe position as well. Again, transitions into the mount, but it's against the cage. Oh, Dylan Douglas yeah. transitions. Now inside the open guard, close guard of Leon Hill. Absolutely brilliant from Dylan. The much rangier, longer fighter creeping that guard up the back of Dylan Douglas. 
Yeah, Leon's guard's open, so. Dylan should at least try and step over and get into half guard like he's done. Almost like he's listening to you, pushing the leg down. Elbows from the bottom from Hill. Uh, yeah, they're actually pretty nasty. And one of them kind of connected at the back of the head. These are legal as they're coming in at that, coming in at that arc as opposed to that 12 to six. Yeah, Dylan's at far too many of them. He really should have been trying to get out of there. And it looks like he's possibly cut in the back. Looks like he may be trying to set up a head and arm, but not a lot of time left to make it happen. Dylan needs to get a few shots up here in the last 15 seconds. Kamora attempt from Leon Hill. May use it to sweep. There's the scramble. Guillotine attempt from Dylan Douglas. And as you say, Josh, a cut somewhere on the side of the head on Dylan Douglas, intended to by Vanilla Malone, one of the best cut people in the game. Yeah, I think that came from one of their nasty elbows. Dylan needs to be wary, but good work again to the body. And as he does that, he circles off to get his back away from the cage. Yeah, Leon's keeping the pressure on here. He's keeping him at range with that jab. Leon Hill stalking, finding the gaps with the shots, but Dylan firing back, never out of the fight. Dylan might need to change levels here to get something offensive off. Leon Hill trying to break the grip via the bicep. Oh, oh that cut has opened up further, hasn't it? Yeah, there was a lovely little knee there on the inside. Leon's got an underhook and going to try and turn him. Now has Dylan pressured up against the cage. A little bit of talking going on in yeah. the cage. I'm not sure what Leon held. Maybe like saying that Dylan was grabbing the shorts, couldn't quite make it out from our position. Dylan's dropped down, trying to get a double. Oh, little cage grab. Yeah. Oh, you can see that cut on the side of the head of Dylan Douglas. Oh. And again, big elbows from Leon Hill. They are really nasty. They're just pinpoint accurate every time. Dylan's trying to get his hands locked. He's got them. As the takedown, what can he do with it? But finds himself. Finds himself in the mounted position from Leon Hill here. We might see Leon Hill posture up and, yeah. and land some of that punishing ground and pound. Yeah, Dylan's holding on for dear life here of his head, but Leon looks like he's going to posture up. That's the mount secured. So Leon's kind of great binding his legs on with Dylan so that he can't kind of buck and try to roll him. And what with this being a pro fight, he has so much more time to get his work in, can yeah. approach it in a more methodical manner. And again, once you give up the mount, chances are if you try and get out of that, you're going to give up the back. Yeah, it's very tricky place. It's almost like you're picking your poison and whenever elbows are involved, it's a very nasty place to be in. Oh, huge elbows. Dylan Douglas can only take so much more of this. Yeah, he's flattened out. Oh, he's got it looks no like it's, oh, Dylan's kind of. Dylan is so game. Yeah, look, that looked like it was underneath the the chin and he somehow managed to roll. But he's taking a serious beat in there and that's... That's it, that's a fair stoppage. Referee Aaron Wallace saving Dylan Douglas pretty much from himself. He would have stayed in there for yeah. the rest of the round, another round. You can never question the heart of Dylan Douglas, but right now, all the accolades and plaudits go to Leon Hill who put on a career, professional career defining performance.